Chapter 27 is called A Wish. That night, in the small dark hut that she shared with Uncle and the sheep, Mig tried to speak of what she had seen. Uncle, she said, Meh. I saw some human stars today. How's that? I saw them all glittering and glowing, and there was a little princess wearing her own crown and riding on a little white tippy-toed horse. What you on about? said Uncle. I saw a king and a queen and an itty-bitty princess, shouted Meg. So, shouted the uncle back. I would like, said Meg, shyly. I wish to be one of them princesses. Car, laughed Uncle. Har, an ugly dumb ting like you. You ain't even worth the enormous lot I paid for you. Don't I wish every night that I had back that good hand in the red tablecloth in place of you. He did not wait for Meg to guess the answer to this question. I do, he said. I wish it every night. That tablecloth was the color of blood. That hen could lay eggs like nobody's business. I won't be a princess, said Meg. I want to wear a crown. A croon. Uncle laughed. She wants to wear a croon. He laughed harder. He took the empty kettle and put it atop his head. Oh, look at me, he said. I'm a king. See my croon. I'm a king just like I always wanted to be. I'm a king because I want to be one. He danced around the hut with the kettle on his head. He laughed until he cried. And then he stopped dancing and took the kettle from his head and looked at Mig and said, Do you want a good clout to the ear for such nonsense? No, thank you, Uncle, said Mig. But she got one anyway. Look here, said Uncle after the clout had been delivered. We'll hear no more talk of princesses. Besides, whoever asked you what you wanted in this world, girl? The answer to that question, readers, as you well know, was absolutely no one. That's the end of the chapter. What do we know now that Mig wants? What does Mig want? Yeah, it says she wants to be a princess. She wants to wear a crown. Why do you think she wants to be a princess and wear a crown? Probably because her life, her life uh, right now is pretty hard. And she thinks that the life of a princess is probably a lot better than her current life. Hmm. All right, let's keep going.